Hey, welcome back. Today we're going to see how to crouch and jump and we're going to make sure that we use stamina when we do those two actions. So as you can see here, I'm jumping and you can see my stamina is going down. And if I crouch, same thing, the stamina go down. So we're going to see how to do this. So the first thing we have to do is all going to our first person character and take your jump that is supposed to be around here. Just make some space so when we press jump we're going to go to a branch and that branch will set if it's true or not depend on what we want to do so in our case we want to jump and it takes stamina at the same time we're going to search for our current stamina and we're going to set that new value and we're going to plug this right to jump here so the condition of this will be our current stamina we're going to make sure that we do have a certain amount of stamina so we're going to search for greater or equal to a certain number in my case here i'm going to put 10 and i'm going to plug that right up here because i want to make sure i have at least 10 stamina to jump if i do have 10 stamina to jump it's going to set my stamina number to the new number and i'm going to be able to jump so from our current stamina when i jump I want to remove a certain amount of energy, right? A certain amount of my stamina. So in my case, I want to remove 10 as well. I'm going to plug it right up here. So when I press jump, it's going to if I have it more than 10. If I do have more than 10, it's going to remove 10 from my current stamina and set this to be the my new number. So if I have 100, it's going to set now to 90. And I'm going to be able to jump. If I release my key, so when I press spacebar and release it it's gonna stop jumping we're gonna wait a certain amount of seconds so in my case i'm gonna put one second and i'm gonna search to regain my stamina uh, there we go regain stamina so i'm gonna get back my stamina slowly over time so we jump we have more than 10 yes or no if we do we're gonna go to true is going to remove 10 It's going to set that stamina to the new number and we're going to jump one more step jumping is going to wait one second and it's going to regain our stamina so let's try it out so i'm there everything is good and if i jump my stamina remove 10 from it until i have no more so let's just run so we have no more stamina now there is no more stamina, so I can jump until I have 10. There we go. So we can see that the code is working here. So we're going to do the same thing for crouch. So first thing we're going to do, go in the project setting under input and add an action mapping for crouch. As you can see here. So when you have that, now we can search for crouch and we're going to take our action event for crouch. So when we press crouch, we're going to search for flip-flop only if you want the flip-flop to only press once so you don't have to hold your key right me i don't want to hold crouch so i'm going to go to a flip-flop and i'm going to go to a branch that branch will verify the same condition as here so technically we could take all of this and just put it down here and plug it right there because crouch take a little bit less energy than jumping. So I'm going to put five and we're going to set our current stamina to that new number. So exactly what we just did for jumping. So after setting our stamina, we're going to crouch. So we're going to take our function to crouch that already come in the engine. And we're going to take our Boolean crouch and we're going to put it there and put that to true. So when we press again, we want to uncrouch. So we're going to search for uncrouching and we're going to take our boolean here again and we're going to make sure it's uncheck and we're going to regain regain our stamina so regen stamina so an extra step we have to do for crouching because by default you can't crouch in a game so we're going to go here on character movement and search for crouch and you will be able to have this box here see i mean you're going to be able to see this box and make sure it's check and if it's check you're going to be able to crouch if you do not do this you won't be able to crouch so let's try it out 
So um, here in the game, press C. I'm crouching, press C, going up, press C, going down, press C, going up. All right, so if I uncheck this, you're gonna see I press C and nothing is happening. The stamina go down, but nothing is happening. So it's really, really important that you have this check. There we go. So everything is working now. We can jump, we can crouch. So that's pretty much what I wanted to show you how to drain some stamina when you do certain actions. So I will leave you on this and see you on the next one.